What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough, the 2022, maybe 2023 edition. So, in our last episode, we finally got to Agritech City, got to discover a few things, went to the Burnt Tower, and we woke up three legendary dogs. Yeah. And two of them are roaming, so chances are we might find them at some point. Now, in the last episode, I was kind of indecided of what I wanted to do. Either go to the Pokemon Gym, or go to the Kimono Girls. And I did check out my last walkthrough, and I kind of would like to do the whole thing again. And that is go straight to the Kimono Girls, because, yeah, <laughs> yeah, we are not ready for... We are not ready for what's coming right here. So, let's go right ahead and, you know, strategically make our Pokemon better right here. So, let's go straight to the Kimono Girls, because we will be receiving something pretty cool. Now, talk to this guy, he's like, not only are the Kimono Girls great, or great dancers, they're also skilled at Pokemon. I always challenge them, but I, I've never even said, or I never even left a scratch. Lad, if you can defeat all the Kimono Girls, I'll give you a gift. Alrighty, bring it on. Okay, so as you guys can see right here, we got six Kimono Girls, I think, five Kimono Girls. And they all have some type of evolution, so let's go right ahead and, uh, take him on. You have lovely Pokemon. May I see them in battle? Yes, you can. Now, in the later versions, in the remated versions, uh, the Komodo Girls would have a, or will have a much more, uh, bigger significance in the game, revolving the, the legendary Pokemon of your choice. As you can see right here, we got a Flareon. Not a problem. And, uh, well, this is a big problem now. Sand attack. And here comes a water gun attack right here. And, yes, we are powerful, we are mighty, and, well, we're gonna be doing this again. And, yeah, she's gonna keep on, uh, sand attacking us, which is annoying right here. So, we got to beat this Flareon quicker. And, oh, nearly defeat Flareon. Let's go one more time. And that right there has, well, we both missed right there. So, let's go ahead and see... Miss, miss, there we go. And just like that, we have defeated Flareon right there. Look at that. Okay, so that gives us some more points. Lucky grows to level 21. And, well, the Kimono Girls. Well, Kimono Girl Naoko, Naoko, or Nako, has been defeated. Okay. And because of that, we won another prize from our mom. We still need to check up on that stuff. Hi, Draven, how are you? Found a useful shopping item, so I brought it with your money. Okay. So we're gonna have to go into the PC and look. Alright, so the next Pokemon trainer right here might have an Espeon, from what I remember, so let's go straight for a Dark type right here. Now, I talked to her, and she's like, I enjoyed that bout. I would like to see you again. Yes, I would. I always dance with my Pokemon. Of course, I also train them. Oh, so she trains them. Okay, so here we go, taking on Sayo, and well, she is going to be having her Espeon, so I was correct about that one right there. And well, here we go, Hera, you're two levels below it, you, you should be fine. Let's go with an Ember attack, and here comes a Tail Whip attack. And well, defense has fallen, but here we go, Ember attack should do something. And you know what? We should probably go for a Leer attack right here. Of course, this Pokemon is going to be hitting us with physical attacks because, uh, well, its psychic attacks can't do anything right here. So let's go with an Ember attack again. And just like that. Ember attack for the win. And that doesn't do really a lot. Okay, so let's go with a fighting type attack. It is physical. So let's see. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Okay, so, yeah, we're not doing anything right here, so, yeah, there's the sand attack. And, well, we, our accuracy has fallen right there. So, let's see, let's see what ends up happening right here. And, well, we're, we're taking some points away from this guy, or from this chick, but, yeah, she's lowering our defense. And one more, yeah, one more tackle attack could actually do it. And, oh, critical hit nearly defeats this guy. And she is trying to go for a sand attack, but here comes an ember attack, and just like that, we have defeated Espeon as a critical hit. This will increase Hera's attack, or Hera's a level to level 16 right here. 
There we go. Sayo has been defeated. Okay. Talk to her. She's like, rhythm is important for both dancing and Pokemon. All right. Time to really, really put our... Uh, time to really do stuff right here. So this time we're going to be going with Chico because we do have a move capable of beating this next Pokemon right here. Isn't my beret pretty? Oh, a Pokemon battle? Yes. Okay. So here we go. Taking on Kimono Girl Zuki. And she's going to have Umbreon right here, the dark type Pokemon. Now, Umbreon is more of a special defense Pokemon right here. And it is weak against bug type Pokemon since it is a dark type. So Fury Cutter is going to be doing it. And here comes the Pursuit of Happiness. Not really. And, well, let's go again. Fury Cutter. There we go. And, yes, we're gonna get, we're gonna keep on getting stronger right here. So, let's keep it going. Fury Cutter again. And, just like that, Umbreon has been defeated. And that gives us a, quite a few experience points right there. And, bam. That's how you do it. Yes, I feel happy about that. So, let's see what she has to say. I put a different flower in my beret every month. Okay, all right, so the next Pokemon trainer might have a Yeah, might have a Vaporeon. So let's go right ahead and take see what she's all about. Oh You're a cute trainer. Would you like to battle? Yes, we will And well here it is guys Taking on Kimono girl Kuni and she will be coming out with Vaporeon right here So look at that Vaporeon's looking pretty cool but Fluff Bolt is about to smash right here. So here we go. Thunderbolt or Thunder Punch for the win. And that nearly defeats Vaporeon. Oh my god. Vaporeon's looking like. Okay, so yeah, you're not going to do that to me. So here we go. Thunder Punch for the win. And just like that, we defeated Vaporeon. And that increases our experience points by a lot. Holy crud. You're stronger than you look. What's that supposed to mean? All right, talk to her. I trained a lot, so I thought I was a capable, a capable trainer. I guess I'm not. Okay, so obviously the last Pokemon has to be Jolteon. So we're going to go with the secret weapon, Serpentera, and see what this is all about. Do you like my dancing? I'm good at Pokemon too. Okay. Bring it on. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Kimono Girl Miki. And we're going to be going against Jolteon. Now, this is completely different from the first time I battled all these Kimono Girls. If I remember correctly, I only used Relic, my Eevee, to actually try and level it up right here. Uh, this time around, I'm actually going for something a little different, and that is, like, you know, beating them with uh, their type disadvantage. And right here, Serpentera is going to be messed up once he beats this guy. Look at this. Dig Attack for the win. And, yeah, Serpentera is unfair. And 700 points says it's at level 21. And, bam. Look at that. Okay. Oh, you're good at Pokemon, too. Yes, I am. Okay, so what do you have to say for yourself now? I can keep dancing. Uh, uh, dan or, I can't even read. Holy crud. Let's see what she says. I can keep dancing because there are people who enjoy what I do. My Pokemon keep me keep my spirit keep, keep my spirits up too. Wow. All right. So after defeating the Kimono Girls, you can come here and talk to this gentleman. He's like, not only are the Kimono Girls great dancers, they are also skilled Pokemon trainers. I'm I always challenge them, but I, I I never leave a scratch. The way you battled, it was like watching a dance. It was it was a rare treat to see. I want you to have this. Don't worry. Take it. Here we have the HMO3 Surf, and this is a move that we absolutely need, especially for our good old buddy, uh, Lucky right here. So, bam, we're victorious. And you know what? Let's go right ahead and check the PC. Our mom has bought us three different gifts, and I have yet to take a look at them, so let's go right here to the PC. Go to Draven's PC, and you withdraw, and you have two super potions and a repel, so... I guess that's okay. Anywho, that is pretty much it right there, guys. In the next episode, 
We're not going to go into the Ecritique City Gym. We are still going to be training our Pokemon. We're going to be doing a lot of adventures, picking up some stuff and all that, and everything else in between. So, it might be maybe an episode or two before we even get into the Ecritique City Gym. Maybe just one episode. Maybe two. I don't know. Depends. But thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode. If you guys want to make a donation to the channel right here, heart button's right there. Links in the description below. If you guys want to join and watch Pokemon Silver for uh, members only, there it is. Click on the click on the link right there. Or no, no, don't click on the link. Just go to my channel, click on the button, you'll join. Bam, you'll get the exclusive uh, videos right there. Thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys next time.